yeah, this is gonna get creepy a bit. Walking into a psych ward. Mental hospitals. Never. One place torture is considered for your own good. That's a little preachy, isn't it? If their experiments ever succeed in restoring a person's sanity, I better hope it was at the expense of the person's memory. That's a stereotype. It only happens in stories and movies. Probably. Ready? Maybe. Scoff. Relax. We're out of the graveyard. And into the frying pan. Crazy Wait, town? fire? A big what? improvement. Crazy town. Lazy town. Never mind. People who see things nobody else can see end up living here. Not oh, that crazy. so, Come so on. we're coming home for you? Is that is that it? Show us that little lip ring. I'll help you get inside, but. But I'm running. But what? Look, if we're gonna ask this girl Iris about this contract, the asking needs to be done by a living person, right? Unless she can see things too, and that's why she's there. Just remember who opens the door for you, tough guy. Yeah, yeah. All right, kid. You're up. I just find a way to get Iris's room number. Um, hi. I need your help. I'm looking for a friend. Visiting hours are over. Right. Mm -hmm. But, but, she was with the cops. Then go talk to the cops. Well, you're real helpful. See, I, I did, and, and they said that she was a danger to herself, and... I can't help you. Of course not. You don't want All to. All right. Just need to stall her, okay? We have to figure out what her weaknesses are. Maybe these things on her desk will help us. Nope, oh, she's got a paralyzed son. It's the T-Rex. That's the one. She's definitely afraid of dinosaurs. It's not gonna be that. Visitation is severely limited. Yeah, yeah. All right, what else we got? Anything? Possess. Influence. The boy. I win. I hate being here and wondering if you're okay. You're all I have left. Just like this girl's friend is all she has left. How do you, how do you know Sorry. that? I know how hard it can be when someone depends on you. What's your friend's name? Iris. Uh, Iris Campbell. I Isis. I Iris. Not terrorist. Yes. It looks like your friend Iris is here. Everything's gonna be okay. That's just Thanks. weird. I, I feel better. Creepy. What's your room number? I just I get this. Just need to get my eyes on her computer screen. Oh, right. Um. Peek. Room 216. Awesome. Oh, I need to actually view it. Choom, choom, choom. Electroshock therapy. It's room tonight. 216. We gotta find it quick, Joy. She's scheduled for electroshock. Ooh, but right, first, kid. let me take a selfie. Coast is clear. Ooh, something about the killer. No one has been able to solve the mystery of the bell killer in Salem, not even the mystery of the symbol itself, since there seems to be no bell at the scene of each crime. Could it be that the killer is leaving an autograph? Seems to be no bell at the scene of each crime. I thought there was a bell at each crime. Are you write that right? A statement of identity? If it has to do with his, with his origins, the logical conclusion would be that the killer originally hails from Philadelphia, another city rich in history and home of the most famous bell in America. But are police willing to consider this bold approach if it means solving the case and saving dozens of lives? Anyway, why wouldn't they? That's the, that's the job, right? It's kind of, kind, of, kind of a weird thing going on here with their the way they're handling the investigation. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Another shiny thing. Shiny thing! Tabloid article. Ooh. A bizarre death of Luxaturna Mental Hospital in Salem may be connected to a string of murders throughout the town. A source confirms that a female mental patient has was found dead, strangled with a cloth bathrobe belt. It might be the first of the recent murders to be committed in such a secure area. It means no one is safe anywhere, said a terrified woman who had spoken directly to a witness. I heard there were all kinds of, dang of drawings on the wall of her cell and that the bell symbol might have been there. I'm sure it was him. Kind of slipping into a weird, like, female C-3PO sound? I don't know. Something. 
Ooh, ooh, room, room, something, things, things, no things. Come on. Oh, guess I should, uh, no, nothing. Okay, here we go. Up the room, 216, second floor. That's how, that's how numbers work, right? Do, 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 shiny thing, shiny thing. News article. Following a strident editorial on the very pages that question the ability of the Seattle Police Department to complete completely investigate the Bell Killer case. Lead Investigator Lieutenant Javier Rex Reyes announced that six additional officers are being assigned exclusively to the case. While unavailable for direct comment, Reyes was quoted in a recent SPD press release as saying, In a department of this size, the rep this represents an enormously significant shift of resources, which should reassure citizens of the gravity of this case, and a resolve to bring it to a conclusion. I know that's not his voice at all, but I, I just, I, I don't know, whatever, fine. Shut up. Whoa, hey, that thing. What? In the hell? Oh, it's a straight jagger with the uh, chains, okay. Yeah, I only need nine more. Never gonna find them. We got that, but we don't have any, uh... Ooh, shiny thing. Shiny thing. Yeah, and? They can't see me, can they? I just need to go, like, screw it for her. Wait a minute. Hey, there. Come on. Iris is due for shock therapy in 15 minutes. All right. Calm down. Shock therapy? Yep, it's, it's Oh, a shit is right. Let's get moving. Yeah. Julia has been everywhere in this town. Rodin was so good to come along. I know it's been hard for him dealing with my mood swings. I think there's something serious going on in my head. And I know he suffers the consequences along with me. But to be so supportive, to be my rock, that takes a real man. I will get through this. I will make this all worth the struggle. She's crazy. I mean, I know she's crazy, but oh, hi. <laughs> all right, it's not much help, but whatever. Another camera, get on it. Where? Where's the other camera? Oh, there it is. Got it. But they're shiny things. Oh, that's just the... Plus, ooh, ooh. Reveal it. Reveal yourself to me. Do, do, do. You know, maybe if they showed a clock, I'd actually be worried. But no, no clocks. Nothing in here. Mm. Oh, that's where we go talk about our feelings. What's in this room? Hey, dear. The bug's crawling up the wall. Can't get anyone to spray them. I'm not gonna try to squash them again. All the blind people put the restraints on me. Very still <laughs> can't blind people. They put them on me. Just because they can't see the bugs? Yeah. What if I just borrowed the helicopter and left a little note? Could work. Gonna, gonna go, go, go for another flight. Take a little take a little leap off the top of the building in your helicopter. No. Not as invisible as you hanging out. How did you see that? Not what I meant. The thing to understand about Mrs. Gwynn is that her. Oh, there we go. Gotta, gotta do this. Thing. TV's going weird, orderly. Check it out. Go, oh, girl. Any kind of anger, but particularly male anger, is really can I, can a trigger I skip point across for her. Why is she so still there? I realize that dealing with patients can be a hmm. Is this TV going on the fritz again? Yes. A cop got killed tonight. It's been a long night, hasn't it? Crazy. Something about being crazy. Um, what else can I? It's messing up again. You should get closer. Come on. Come on. I already did the camera. Oh, do I gotta do it again? I think I gotta do it again. Now, now here she goes. Here she goes. Ooh, found a thing. Ah, find a thing. Collect it. Tablet Article Two. In a shocking new discovery, our staff has found compelling evidence that recent brutal murders in Salem repeat another unsolved killing spree from 1972 to 73. Hmm. Like the current spree, the killings were all unconventional, bizarre, and unsolved. And they are there are there conventional ways to kill people. Like there's a book, a, 
a, a list of conventions for killing. Anyway, and they all bore they all bore the mark of a bell. Hmm. Not as prominently as recent murders, but definitely a similar signature style mark. While Sam and police were unwilling to comment on any relationship to their cold case file, the evidence is overwhelming that a serial killer has returned to Salem to wreak a new reign of terror. Or a copycat killer has done his research. Let's see, 72 to, let's see, this game was 2014. It's like 40 years? Yeah. Don't think it's the same person. It could be. But they would have been a very young serial killer. 